blocks the shot. Oh, snap. Oh, and a quick entry. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God, he slammed me. God, damn, he slammed me. Alright, finally finished our five weeks of training. Let's check out these social medias right real quick. It's gonna be a great weekend. And let's do up. Get you Terry. I'm tired of these savages over there on the timeline. At least I got some fans out there, thank you. Oh the Really, Yolanda? Oh my god, savage. Wait a minute, it's good. <laughs> I don't know, left hook on official? <laughs> alright. Alright. Well, <laughs> that one was funnier, I gotta admit. Alright, let's get this fight started with Jake Matthews. Coming up next is the UFC welterweight division matchup. Here we go. His third fight in the cage. Here comes the doctor. Well, pretty much every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on. Look at him. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge and nine of fight, the striking nine fight game. By knockout, the ability and to one set traps, the ability to by find knockout, the jab, the, the ability pin. to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbow. And I'm calling he second round knockout. Every weapon I'm going to go for first round, but let's go second round. Finish his opponents. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking and flows off dude of. Called Jake we'll see Matthews. how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. All right, here he is for my money. Might be the most well-rounded fighter in this division. A true mixed martial artist at his core, and he believes he'll have a lot of advantages in this matchup tonight. Everyone talked about him being well-rounded. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that can do All right, he might give me a challenge at maybe. such a high level. Yeah, he's comfortable wherever the fight goes. Maybe he'll grapple tonight. Maybe he'll strike. Makes him a hard guy to prepare for. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. So a more than five-year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age with similar height and some differences in reach. We send it inside the octagon. We find Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of nine wins, no losses. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 158 pounds. Fighting out of Long Island, New York, USA, the Doctor. Yeah. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 14 wins, 4 losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Jake, the Celtic Kid, Matthews. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. You ready? Yo, Cage. Quick dance ball. His opponent Let's go. would be wise to get the guard up here early. This what's up? What's won up? His last three fights, all of them by flush on, knockout. Up? Each knockout more impressive than the last. What's up we'll the leg? Protect your leg, boy. Tonight. Protect the legs. Oh. And they separate. Protect well, your legs. His kickboxing best oh, snap. Tonight. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, 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 no. I mean, the get kicks are coming in bunches. Come here. Normally it's the hands. Tonight, you ain't going to take me down. Here. Oh, damn. Come here. Stances here. All right, going for the early Got him. Down. He gets it, so no What's surprise up? he wanted to get this fight to the ground. What's and up? that is certainly a good sign for him moving forward in this fight. He felt as if he had a massive advantage What's in the up? grappling 
up. What's up? He was able to secure that take that block. very early in the first round. Back to his feet. Stuff oh, no, you don't. Down there. How no, you don't. Is his take no, you don't. Down? You ain't taking me down. Nice straight punch. Beautiful body kick land right under the elbow. Oh, oh snap. What I'm stunned. I'm stunned. To throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. And now he lands a combination. Come here. Okay, you got that. Oh, portal. Oh, a nice punch out of the break there after Woo. he had caught the leg. Got him. So he is really starting to put it all together now and clearly yeah. seems to have found the time to that move. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, snap. Oh, and a quick entry. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God, he slammed me. God damn, he slammed me. Holy. I mean, do I survive that or is it my red my last Damn, he slammed the shit out of me. It's over. It's over, John. Oh, nice job using his strength. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, you don't. He's going to start looking to land big shots from the top. 90 seconds now to go in round one. Now the guy's got on bar. He's attacking oh, it on him. Right. He's going to attack on bar here. Oh, crap. This is not good. It ain't going my way right now. And he's out. Crazy accuracy and efficiency with these ground and pound strikes here. And if you're the opponent, you got to intelligently defend or the referee's going to stop. Come on, get off me, man. But you can see him now starting to gain posture and the intensity at which he's throwing these ground strikes is starting to improve. Come on, get up, get up. to elevate because he oh, knows that he can get, get the pitch. All right, side control now. Oh, the ground and pound is there. Get your dumb ass off me, man. Outstanding ground and pound. Oh, Here's my some God. Of a lost art in MMA, at least in terms of making uh. sure that every strike counts. Not an issue for him. He's making every single one of them count. He is not Damn. being bad. He's not I got a feeling he won that every round. Every punch that lands, he wants you to feel it. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Oh, well, he's man. He's a tough guy. He's he going to make it me. to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Oh man, bastard slammed me, man. Oh, he's gonna pay for that. Round two here. That was a nice strike. Matthews gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Come on. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. Nah, you ain't and taking me down. Is he accurate. He's also keeping very busy. Single follow tie now. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Right into his opponent's midsection. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Got him. Come on. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, yeah. but really unable to What's string up? anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his yeah. jab. Got he may it. throw the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have oh, the intent come on. on landing it. He's got to be come confident on, that it's going to land, up, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Well, good news, bad news, right? The strike there lands, but just not much steam on it because his gas tank seems to be on the verge of it. Hey, oh, gets oh no, no. It wasn't oh, for any lack of effort, but God. finally that shot was good enough to get his opponent down. I don't know how many times, John, I could have watched this guy shoot <laughs> take down attempts without securing one. Yeah, stun your ass. Now his What's opponent up? in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize What's it. He's coming high. Stun your ass. now he's got him hurt bad. Well, he was a little bit oh, lackluster boy. in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He is really pissed. Oh. Yeah. He's What's up? What's up? What's up? Oh, crap. Two minutes now to go round two. Oh, he's attacking oh, two. No. Damn it. You are not making me tap. Got 
Got his chin in, but now it's starting to slip under the neck. Nicely done. Oh, it's a show. Don't mess off. Oh, he's got the knee on the belly. Could be trouble defensively. Come Side on, get control your ass now. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position Come off on. the bottom. Come on. Strong bottom work here. Staying busy. Relentless Come on, gotta get out. Gotta get out of it. Come on. Matthews. Come on, get out. Get out. Come Useful on. Strike there. The ground and pound on point tonight. Come on, get up, get up. All right, north-south position here. We'll see if the crowd can be mature about this, DC. Come on, get up. Come on, get up. Get up, get up. All right, that's the end of round number Oh, two. my God. Oh, it's, damn it. You are winning this fight. You hear me? But I need you to stay doing what you do. All right? Very open uh, right, let us get some highlights from that previous round, DC. And how about just the, the sheer volume uh, of the kicks damn. I don't know why this dude's energy bar isn't completely zapped. You can't throw that many head kicks over the course of a fight. But I guess if you're landing them, you might as well keep doing it. All right, so after he landed a high right. number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round. Last gets round. He should stay this course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Come on. Yeah. As he lands and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Nice Come kick on. with the right hand. Gotta get out of it. Fighters back to their feet here. That is a thuddy play. Oh! Yeah. Well, now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Whoa! Yeah. Oh, he might be out. Ah, come on. Damn. Come on, come on, come on. Oh! Whoa! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Come on. Come on. He's almost out. Oh, straight right. Yeah. Get out of that, get out of that, get out of that, get out of it. Come on, get out, get out, get out. You gotta be careful, Arbar. Come on, out, 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 out. Oh, he picks him up and slams yeah, him down. Yeah, slam your ass down, down boy. Explosive slam to lift him and slam him out of that armbar. Go right into side control. Now let's see what he does, right? Sometimes when you do that, the choke or the submission can get tighter, but he was able to evade it there. Yes. All right, come on. Watch the strike lands, Damn, but I am so my, my children. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, come on. At this point, early in the fight, you saw. Whoa! Yeah, come here. Come here. Come on. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by Matthews. All right, dominant position here. He's got the full mount. A lot of different ways he can go here. Maybe try to find an arm bar or just get the ground and pound. He can't attack submissions, but those submissions get up. will get present up. themselves once he is landing that brutal ground and pound he is known for. Because then his opponent will start to get a little bit Damn, desperate to get out under him, which Damn. will then in turn leave arms dangling. Oh! <laughs> Finally, lay your ass down. You can't be trouble, man. Lay his ass down. <laughs> oh my god, that was a tough fight. That was a tough fight right there. All right, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're going to find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick Woo! to finish the fight. Woo! But don't ignore all the work he did with his hands. And give credit to the opponent. The opponent was in there Damn. every step of the way. He and gave me some trouble. I'm going to lay his ass tonight, down. Both guys have to you are not going to deny me my test knockout. Here now, Buffer with the official decision. Yeah. Woo, that was a close one.
All right, we finally finished our four weeks of training. Time to take on Mike Perry, but first let's check out the timeline. Yep, I'm getting finished. We got this, that did not make it work. Let's also, that last fight was not easy. Thanks, Catherine. Is that it? Oh. Go get it, Dr. Knockout. Yup, thank you, Maggie. I think that's about it. Let's just make sure we have any more pop ups. Yup, that's it. Let's get this fight started. Coming up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. Fourth fight in the octagon. Let's go. Well, I'm excited comes. for this one. This is Ooh, a kickboxer of the shirt. highest order. He has so many different kicks and punches in his arsenal and figures to try to keep this on the feet here tonight. The beautiful thing that he does is he throws that front push kick to create distance when a guy starts to get too close. All right, 10 fights by KO, it. undefeated, it, and one and last fight with knockout. Range, That's right. To blast high kick. He doesn't always intend on landing him, but he beats up your arms with high kick after high kick after high kick. And then as you get desperate, you start to run into knees, and he does not need much space to land a knockout punch. This guy is one of the best strikers we've ever seen in the UFC. And if you don't find the striking range early against this guy, you could be in real trouble. Well, this guy's got some hands on him, DC, and sometimes he takes issue when we call him a boxer because he is an MMA fighter and a well-rounded one at that. But it's hard not to lead the dance and lead the walk with the boxing skills that really are off the charts. Yeah, it's unbelievable. So he can be mad, but All I right. would be happy That's how this to one be called will be a so boxer difficult. if I possess that set of knockout skills. Artist, if I had the ability to mix the target as well fight. as he does. When he's most comfortable, uh, when he's this might going, be a tough when one. the head is moving, when it's never on the center line, when he's landing body shots, when he's following that left body shot with that beautiful left hook, that's when he is most dangerous. It's a guy that for all that he can do in the octagon, at the end of the day, he was a boxer first and a fantastic boxer at that when he stepped into the UFC. And don't sell yourself short, you gotta forget it. I'm trying, but I'm not this guy. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, some differences in height and reach. Now to get a start of the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a kickboxer holding a professional record of 10 wins, no losses. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 158 pounds. Fighting out of Long Island, New York, USA, the Doctor. Yeah. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a boxer holding a professional record of 16 wins, six losses. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Orlando, Florida. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Levine. The veteran Eve right. Levine draws the assignment here. You ready? Break dance song. All right, so here Let's he go. is Let's ready start. for round one. This man is all the rage given what he did his last time out. Ooh, it was a missed. win by flush knockout. Now he'll try to keep the momentum going as the challenges get more difficult. You win in the UFC nine oh. times out of oh. ten. The next opponent is decidedly better. That is certainly the case here tonight. All right. Take my time. Really making good use of his reach advantage there with that punch. Can't go from the high kick. Man, DC, his hands look good. A lot of volume, a lot of accuracy tonight. He's doing a great job being accurate, but he's also Got that body. very fast. Get, Get that body. What's speed, up? Right? Oh, effective strike there. What's what up? What's up? Took you down, boy. What's up? What's up? This is not at all ideal. No, this is not ideal. Because now he has to try and stop 
his opponent All right, from taking that's him it. away. That's How do you do <laughs> I don't want to waste my stamina. Feet? You start grabbing the feet with the hands, lead with your hips, grab the feet with the hands, pass the feet to the side. Okay, really? Start to lead All right. with your knees and try to get the side control. What's up? Seems to have timed that counter pretty well. Oh, crap. Oh, now you got me. double leg takedown. Both fighters get up now. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from What's this up? fighter. What's up? Harry gets caught by that straight punch. Can't take too many more of those. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body right. shots. Ooh. Ooh, he put, okay, he got me. He got me. Oh, Every time snap. These guys he got come together, man. You just hear the, the punches and everything. Oh, no, like you don't. Both, both very powerful, very, very explosive. Nice stick with the right hand. Strong defense there to block the shot. Block that. Woo! Oh, big oh. Hit. Okay, he got that. Oh, what's up? Limping here. What's up? Oh, what's up? Level three uppercut. You ain't taking me down. Alright. Mixes it up nicely in terms of right. staying heavy and Ooh, also he staying active. Well, a lot of people think he might have the best jab in this division, certainly using Yeah! Right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot. That he's really a great job. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Oh. This fight's gonna oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh crap. Ten seconds now to go in the round. Right. Get your ass off me. Five minutes in the books. Alright. I think I won that round. Cause I was stunning his ass. I caught his legs and his head. Watch the shot. Boom! Definitely stunned his ass and dropped him. So I definitely should have won that round. All right, round two. You ready? Here we go. You ready? Round two on the way. Well, you saw us reference it in the tail to take DC. He's got right. the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in landing that shot. Oh crap! Oh, strong punch there by Corey. It's such a fast leg kick. Yeah, got well, it. He's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked. The hands are high. Pretty good job. Oh, back fit. Okay. Ooh, but I your ass. Appreciate uppercut. A beautiful uppercut. It landed beautifully. Perfect placement on that shot. Back to the feet. All right. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up. Oh! Woo! He's the fight thus far. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Got him. Second leg takedown attempt here, and did that get you out of your seat? Beautifully done by him there. Oh, man. I jumped up and down. Am I watching the Olympics or a big <laughs> martial art? Now the guy's got on bar. He's attacking it on it. Go on. Continuing to try to manipulate the head here. Can I get it? Can I get it? Can I get it? No, I ain't get it. Then he's out. And they both stand up. Well, it's not due to a lack of effort. Right. He continues to throw, but this is like double A striking. This is not high level. Yeah, you can't be missing. It takes so much energy to just throw a strike, but to be with okay, like court this, is it court only is exhausts you because every moment he's trying to throw to knock his opponent out, you're just catching air. Got the body. It, it doesn't feel good. It's also embarrassing. <laughs> oh crap! What, what did I do that for? Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. All right. 
right? So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really oh, picked no up the don't. pace oh, in round two. Oh, okay, he caught it. 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 lack of effort, but finally that shot was good enough to get his opponent down. I don't know how many times, John, I could have watched this guy shoot takedown attempts without securing one. It's almost like out of pity. You feel good for him to finally get it done. Now what does he do with this top control? Uh, let me get up. I'm gonna stand. Oh, back up again. You can't hold a good man down. Oh. Oh, man, What's up with your legs? Up. What's up with your legs? All right, round three coming up next. All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned a huge head strike to yeah. stop his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I, I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. I think that was three straight the cup. Yep, that was three but straight the other cup. side has to be concerned. They have to figure something. All right. All right, I'm done finished playing with this dude. Trying to knock him out. You ready? You ready? There you go. Checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh, and he connects oh, with the punch snap. there. We'll All see right. if there's more where that came from. Boxing. Big strike lands. Oh, that's Big it. Strike lands. That's now it. Try to take down that that's it. I told you I was done playing around. Lay your ass down. Yeah, that right there is a high level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Yeah. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. Make that so, 11 a huge, and huge win oh. for that young fighter here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout Ooh. just a moment ago. It he was went right down. hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. Night, night. And they're just, just laying into him. Mm. Mm. And he was out. And here once more with the official decision is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine called the stop to this contest at 41 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, the doctor. Well, we yep. congratulate him on a huge <laughs> knockout here tonight. He'll probably keep that smile while he's sleeping yeah. tonight after what he was able to produce. Here. He's going to be smiling for a really long time. When you get a knockout like that, not only do you get the win, you also yeah. both times walk away with a $50,000 bonus check. Uh, fights. We got that win. See a lock knockout. That was a great great stuff. That was a knockout. Thank you, Dana White. Yup. Thank you, Dominic. That's right. I'm one of the best. Now, who I got next? Who's next? Diego Alameda. Hmm. I got five weeks for this. Uh, yeah, I'll take them on. All right, five weeks this fight. So anyway, we do it here for now. I'm gonna spend this time getting five weeks for training. Then, we're about to start our next fight. That's it for now.